My name is Kong Zhuoming, student number 20397009, majoring in accounting. I'm going to do a reflective talk on career passport. I will speak from five perspectives. They are a reflection on the employability tool, a reflection upon your time in enhancing your business mind, a reflection upon your time at university, my career plan, and a message to my future self. The purpose of the speech is to have a more complete understanding of myself, improve my employability, and make a clearer plan for the future through the analysis of myself and the summary of my university study and life. Employability tool complete self-assignment by selecting and filling blank question and generates my employability profile which helps me understand such aspects of life literacy, helps me analyze areas suitable for development and improve my employability. From the report, my self-assignment was from high to low is ethical, cultural, and social literacy, emotional literacy, rhetorical literacy, occupational literacy, personal and critical literacy, and basic literacy. This is the first time I have used this tool. I will see this page and update my profile very well. The tool makes me realize that I am enterprising and want to contribute to the world. But planning, effort, and the, the professional skills need to be strengthened. In particular, I need to improve digital literacy. I should enhance my ability to be confident, creative, and critically identify and use technology. For example, start with a simple one. I can first specify a 30-day plan to study digital literacy and send videos to record what I have learned every day. I gained a lot from every workshop in the Enhancing Your Business Mind course. which impressed me most was Seminar 8, Pitching and Marketing Each Other, and Seminar 9, Online Problem Solving. Seminar 8 is a pitching as the second and more experienced than the first. In the future work, no matter what position I take, I have to express what I'm doing clearly so that my leaders and colleagues can better understand me. I believe that this is a basic skill that I will often use in the future. The Seminar 9 is a multiplayer collaboration. Group forms are often used in the course. I'm not very good at communicating with each other because I'm a non-native English speaker. This kind of teamwork method not only gives me the opportunity to learn with my peers of the world, but also exercises my oral expression ability and let me sum up the courage to talk with my classmates, let me more confident. I like Seminar 9 most because this kind of web game is very interesting, which has brought me an impressive class experiences. This is a new area of interest that I have found. In addition, because of the COVID-19, I spend most of time at home and taking class. During the four years of college, I spent the first two years on Chinese couples after the COVID-19, the last two years at home. When I was a freshman, I was full of longing for the beautiful curtain couples, but because of COVID-19, I did not come to the curtain, which made me very sad. If I have a chance, I will definitely go to Australia and see the college. To be honest, I don't know if this is the most suitable major for me because I haven't studied any other major. However, I know that every major is inseparable from hard work. In college, in addition to completing my study, I think I should keep experiencing new things because college is the last preparation before entering the society. Trying them can increase my experience and expand my interest. During college, I made a time schedule through a calendar. For major matters, I set up a mobile phone alarm reminder. I think I am living regularly every day. In my spare time, I do something interesting, such as watching movies and novels. But sometimes, I will indulge the entertainment and do not finish what I plan today, and even delay big things. I should balance my study and entertainment better. I like university. It not only teaches me knowledge, but also teaches me how to be a man. For example, it cultivates and improves the six aspects of life literacy which listed on employability tool. In addition, learning is a lifelong process. Whether I am a student or not, I will keep the enthusiasm of learning new knowledge. 
The next step after graduation is to look for a job or prepare a graduate student. Under the influence of COVID-19, the employment is more difficult, and I always feel nervous. Currently, I find a job as a bank employee, but it has nothing to do with my major. In order to ensure the career path I want, first of all, I will maintain the enthusiasm and curiosity of learning. Second, use employability tool to review regularly and reflect on my capabilities. Third, make career planning, understand the key career information, grasp the opportunity. I think my first job is not necessarily a lifelong job, but only by improving my ability first can I have the chance to find a better career path. I will tell my future self, come on, you are the best. During my time in Curtin University, what I wanted most was to study in Capos. Unfortunately, because of COVID-19, there should be no chance. Besides, I will never forget the Curtin teachers, whose responsible and interesting classes benefit me all of my life. In addition, my advice to the future myself is to have a plan to wear every day in order not to regret wasting time. In conclusion, Career Passport Reflective gave me an opportunity to reflect on my college life and dissect myself through employability tool. It helps me find my strengths and weaknesses and find out ways to improve them. Thus, it is conductive to improve my employability and make a clear plan for the future. That's all. Thank you for your watching. Goodbye.